Good evening and welcome to another vlog from Astrata USA road trip here on Theme Park Worldwide where me and I are here in the car and we're on the way to go and ride a mountain coaster and I'm really looking forward to giving this a go. In terms of its location, it's about a 15 minute drive from Silver Dollar City and we've just spent the day today and then make sure you check out the vlog if you've not already seen it, it's now online here on our YouTube channel and of course I've mentioned it a lot but I will do once more uh, all through these different vlogs that we're filming, they're all going to be in a dedicated playlist in order so you can really keep the track of what we've done on this epic trip uh, and yeah we're only a few days into it so far and yeah we're off to ride a mountain coaster the first of a few that we're actually going to be doing uh, throughout the road trip um, so yeah let's head up there and uh, go and give this one a go hopefully going to be able to take the GoPro on and, and film on it I, I believe that um, you can film on these over here so uh, that's the plan and I'm looking forward to it so in terms of the time it's open to it says it's open till I think 10 o'clock at night it's now eight o'clock uh, we're about five minutes away. So yeah, we're gonna head up there and do it because what I forgot the name again, I'm useless. What's the, it called? This the one? Sawmill Coaster. Sawmill Coaster. Um, yeah, mountain coaster. So let's head up there and have a look. I'll show you a little bit of footage on the road as we uh, drive into it. Bring it on. Just over two miles away there now. Just thought I'd show you a bit of front POV out of the car. You might be all thinking, clean your window. Well, we are going to tonight because we've had a little go at spraying it just uh, with a screen wash. It's not clearing. This is from the drive last night. So we are going to go and get this cleaned off uh, before doing another long drive uh, this evening to our next park. Uh, but yeah, so a couple of miles away, 1.7, four minutes until we get there here in Branson. Here we go. So we've made it and there it is. It's open. New car park there. I think it's pretty new actually. I think it opened a couple of years back. The Branson Sawmill, oh, Mackie D's over there. I'm oh, sorry, the Golden Arch over here, isn't it? Oh, we're just gonna turn right onto here and straight onto the car park. There's also a Starfly here as well. Massive hotel there next to it as well. Here we go, just turning in. Well, welcome to the Branson Sawmill. Let's get parked up and let's go and ride this mountain coaster. Always oh, quite a few people about this evening. Treetop shop. Oh, it's got a proper turnstile and everything. Ah, yeah, there we go. Starts here at the top, and then obviously it brings you back up with that lift hill at the end, I think. Sells merch over there and everything. Oh, yeah, very, very nice around here. Lovely, very touristy. Right there, so we're all paid, and we've got our wristband just here. Use like the contactless system, which is quite cool. And uh, yeah, we've paid for that initial ride, uh, and then also for a re ride on it as well. So it's come to $26 for two rides and if you want to do additional re-rides it's like seven dollars or something like that uh, so here it is really looking forward to giving this a go we've done quite a few of these now uh, throughout europe of course done the one in the uk that we've got in wales so looking forward to it i mean in terms of the length of it i don't really know any facts or, or anything about it so we'll sort of go with it and obviously with this it's got the braking on there you brake as much or as little as you want to i mean i don't think 26 dollars for a couple of rides is too bad obviously if it's really good I might even pay for another go for the sake of seven dollars. So we'll see. I don't think we're going to bother with the Star Flyer. Um, Have you yeah. ever done one of these? You've not. Never. Oh my god! I didn't even realise that. To nope. be fair. Never done it. I've never been to Wales, so never done that. No, nope, never yeah, done it. Yeah, I mean, there's, there's some brilliant ones out there. The longest one in the world in Germany. Uh, absolutely incredible. So let's, uh, yeah, let's make our way around there. I've got the GoPro on. Lady says that I should be fine. So. Yeah, finally some on-ride footage from America, yes. Uh, let's go and ride the Branson Sawmill uh, Mountain Coaster. Right, off we go then, on the Branson Coaster. Really looking forward to this. Alex has just got in front of me. And here we go, it's a sunset ride on this one. Do you like this little viewing area at the top? And apparently the Starflyer opened like four days ago, from what we were chatting to the, uh, chatting to the bloke with just. Right, so with this, keep the bars forward at all times. And then it means that we're not going to break at all. There we go. Of course, if we get too close to the other one, the auto braking will kick in. But hopefully, we're not going to get any of that. Oh, a time. Hey. Oh, it's good fun. Woo! Oh, it's a good look. Oh, brilliant on that corner. It's not trimming it too much. Oh, brilliant. Hey. The thing with the one in Wales back in the UK, it does auto slow it down on the corners a bit too much. Oh, oh, there we go. Oh, we got a second lift hill. There we go. Oh, it's good so far, isn't it? That's amazing. That, that was really good. Like, it doesn't hardly trims it at all. Ready for round two. Yeah, good long ride. Hey. 
Okay, there we go. This is going to take us back up. Nice bit of audio as we uh, head up here. One of our favourites. Yeah, all sorts of LED lighting all in here as well. Yeah, got some really good speed on there. There we go, there's Alex making his way down for round two. I like how he's like trying to push himself forward to get a bit more speed. The golden arch off there to the right. And here we go. The key is with these, make sure you've definitely got the handles forward as soon as you come off the lift hill. Right, let's go. Press your handles forward. Press your handles forward. That was a bad impression, wasn't it? Oh, building up that speed already. That's what we want. Woo! Oh, the Branson Coast here in the USA. Woo! Oh, brilliant on these corners. Hey! Woo! -hoo. Yeah! And there we go. Slow down your car. There we are, down to the end. That was that was really good. Not the best one I've been on. It is like quite short in terms of the uh, the thrill sections on that. However, it's still very good fun. We got another go round on it as well. Hey, off he goes. There we are, lift hill all the way back to the top now of this hill. We're glad we managed to have a ride on it anyway in the sunset. Can't imagine going on it when it's dark is quite as good. So like, there is some good LED lighting and stuff around it, so maybe that'd have make it. But I'm not like overly impressed with that. I think it's okay. I wouldn't say it's anything world class, that one. Uh, I do think the one uh, back in Wales is better in terms of the length. Uh, but however, this doesn't trim as much on the corners, which is good. Uh, but yeah, we've got a couple more of these going to be coming up later in the trip. So stay tuned for those videos here on the channel. That's the view from the start of the vlog when we we're driving up there. Here we are, this long hill all the way back up to the top. And of course, I'll take you around for a second go. Off we go then, round number two. Just met some more fans of Theme Park Worldwide. So big hi out there to you, it was great to have a chat. There we go, in the dark now. What a nice atmosphere there is around here. A little bit of a bar and food area. Oh, there's Alex, he's got his hands in the air down there. Don't know how much you're gonna see on the GoPro with it being darker, but here we go. Oh, this one feels like it's got even more speed, actually. Oh, I'm gonna try and lean into the corners a bit. Yeah. Airtime. Woo! <laughs> oh, this is even better, this one. Oh, wow. Thought it was going to come flying off then. Whee! Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh. Oh, yes. Hey. Really good. And here we go into the brakes. Oh, we've got a bit of dabbing going on in front. Oh, we don't want to be seeing that. We don't want to see that. Right, I'll uh, see you when we get back on the lift hill. Disco lift hill. Welcome to the disco lift hill. We love disco lift hill on Theme Park Worldwide. And there we had Sean Sandbrook with the disco lift hill song. You'll find it on the official Theme Park Worldwide album when it's released next year. Five different CDs. Also be available on Spotify. Right, off we go. Hey, looking forward to this again. Just that anticipation. There we go, guys. Certainly a lot faster this one. Loads better. Hey, lean to the left. Whoa, that's really good at night. Whoa! Blimey! Whoa! I feel it scraping on the sides. Whoa! Excellent. There we go. Right, back up to the top. Well, that's this visit to the Branson Coaster. Couple of rides 
on this wonderful Alpine coaster. And I liked it, it's not one of my favourite ones that I've done. Certainly not the worst one that I've done either though. And it's good that we had a couple of laps on it. I think, you know, we got our money's worth, I would say. I wouldn't want to pay any more for it. Um, but yeah, like $26. It's, not a, it's not a super thrilling ride, but mm. it's a fun ride. It's something you can do to relax in the evening. There's a bar around here, you can just chill out. And it's worth mentioning as well that it is known as the Branston Coaster at the time of this recording. However, they're currently undergoing a brand change yes. to the Branson Sawmill. Sawmill. So if you're looking for this uh, coaster, you're looking for the Branson Sawmill, not the Branson Coaster, which it technically still is. It's just having a refresh because they've got a Starfire that literally opened like two days ago. Yeah, like really good. This whole area around here is lovely. There's so much around here. There's like a Walmart, uh, there's a uh, McDonald's and stuff. Like I say, around here, uh, it's great. Like really nice atmosphere. Free parking at the entrance, really yeah. easy to get to. Nice chilled atmosphere, family friendly. Good laugh. Still a little it. video for you to see, but yeah, hopefully, well, we've got more Alpine coasters coming up. Uh, when we get down to Tennessee, so yeah. And hello to Summer and Co who work on here too. Some lovely staff, they've actually amazing. gave us a photo, uh, a complimentary photo, which is really kind of them as well. So a uh, big thank you so much to the team here at the Branson Sawmill. And yeah, we'll uh, see you again soon for another video here on the part worldwide from this huge USA road trip. Next up, it's Worlds of Fun. That means it's time to cue those credits. <laughs>